to seeing how that case turns out. The Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission, ESCC, now requires all full-time public officers with double or multiple jobs to relinquish the additional positions and pay back to the government any salaries and benefits irregularly earned from public coffers during the period they served in more than one public institution. The move by the anti-graft agency stems from a landmark judgment delivered by the Nyeri Employment and Labor Relations Court in a legal battle pitting ESCC and and one Dr. Agnes Wanjirunjero, Gatama, who has been holding two public jobs, one at the Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology, JK Watt, and the other at the County Assembly of Kirinyaga. Now, sitting in Nyeri Law Courts, Justice Onesmus Macau of the Employment and Labor Relations Court declared double employment of a public officer irregular and unlawful, terming it a violation of Chapter 6 of the Constitution. In his ruling delivered on 20th December 2023, Justice Onesmus Macau concurred with ESCC that once a public officer is employed on a full-time basis, they are not eligible for any other gainful employment since they are expected to dedicate all their work, time and energy to the full-time employer. The Commission's spokesperson, Eric Ngumbi, says that following the court ruling, the Commission has now initiated recovery of all the salaries, allowances, gratuity and other benefits earned by Dr. Agnes Gatama from the Kirinyaga County Assembly for the entire period of five years that she worked in the Kirinyaga County Assembly from 2017 to 2022. ESCC is investigating a number of cases. In fact, in the last three or so years, we have received reports amounting to, I think, 324, out of which 43 files have been forwarded to the DPP with the recommendations to prosecute persons involved. And this is because of a fraudulent acquisition of public property. Because if you have more than one job and you end up earning twice, you have defrauded the public and therefore we have recommended prosecution and other administrative actions such as uh, dismissal from employment and in some cases uh, even a recovery of the monies that the individual earned in uh, the additional employment. ESCC will not stop at uh, that case because we are already pursuing recovery of every single coin that the lecturer and for the five years that she served as a board member of Kirinyaga County Assembly Service Board.